What's up YouTube, it's tay 2 turned and in today's video we are going to be talking about four of the most embarrassing New York drill rappers. So anyways, let's get right into the video. The first New York drill rapper we are going to be talking about is E.B.K. Choppa. Choppa is a drill rapper from Middletown that jacks Cortland and bangs OG, and he also jacks deceased Cortland member B. Diddy as one of his deads. All right, so it all started when a dude that go by the name Kuda B caught E.B.K. Choppa lacking at a train station. He recorded Choppa standing next to police officers while missing one shoe, and they started pressing him for allegedly smoking they mans. The reason Choppa was missing his shoe is because a few minutes before this, Choppa had got jumped by Shaw E.K. and other OGZ's members. After that, he hopped on the train and ran into these dudes. It's a new wedgie man, you heard? E.B.K. Choppa, you the real wedgie man, you heard? You see what happened to your little ass? Yo, so who getting back for Choppa? The 300 niggas? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, so who getting back for Chopper? Oh, shit now, Chopper. Shaw E.K. says the reason Chopper got jumped was because he was hanging around Shimi and 300 members and was also smoking on E. Dot. Next up, we have Batman himself, Use G's. Use G's is a Bronx drill rapper. It all started when D. Thang's manager accused Use G's of stealing the last of their gumbo pack. After he confronted Use G's about allegedly stealing their gumbo pack, things got physical. As you can see, D Thang stands there as Use G's gets haymakers thrown at him and has to dodge the blows to avoid getting knocked out. The sad part about this situation is that the video went viral and had a lot of different reactions. Yo, Use, what the fuck is going on, bro? This nigga mad tough in them songs. Nigga running from a fight with his mans. Nigga stealing weed in Miami. I thought you was up. I thought D Thang came home and gave everybody a bag. Why are you stealing weed from your mans? I, I thought the gumbo was free. Nigga still in the gumbo. So, next up, we have Harlem rapper DD Osama. So, it all started when DD was at the airport with his mom and a YG member that goes by the name Curry pulled up on DD Osama and his mom saying he was smoking on DD's dead brother Nadi Osama and posted the video to his story. Didi Osama, copping in the airport, smoking mad naughty. Suck my dick, nigga. Smoking your brother, nigga. Fuck your brother, nigga. You know what's going on? Everything for Wu Lati, nigga. Smoking naughty, nigga. You not smoking on Wu, nigga. Take your brother up. I would have crashed out, you heard? I'm not, and I'm a rapper too, you heard? But I really get active. I don't do what you do. And I'm on that whip or without my mother, you heard? Pussy, suck my dick. After this video surfaced, a New York Drill blog page posted it, and that's when everybody started reacting to the situation. K-Dot, a.k.a. Nadi Osama's killer, reacted to the situation, saying, The Walk of Shame, LOL. Use G's reacted to the situation by saying, Everybody talking about the dude behind the phone, why your favorite rapper ain't push up for his little brother, y'all gotta shut up. Then D.D. Osama's sister responded to the situation by saying, But I really get active. Get active then, dummy. But as always, let me know what y'all think about the situation down below. Last but not least, we have Cortland drill rapper, Shaw E.K. So this situation all started when Shaw E.K. was chilling on his block with some older heads from his block, and one of them decided to give Shaw E.K. a outrageous wedgie and record it. So yeah, that's all I got for y'all today. 
Let me know what y'all think about it down in the comments. But as always, stay safe, stay blessed, and don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already.